86 miles on the Shell Toey Trace, from Yamacraw to Burnt Mill Bridge. We had a great lunch, nice rest at the Blue Heron camp. <clears throat> great morning. Started out at Yamacraw, followed the river. The Rock Creek was a little high, so uh, we had to take the uh, alternate route. So we backtrack onto the road and uh, went around to back to the Sheltoe. Got to see Cogar Arch. That was a nice treat. I highly recommend that if you're coming the other way. Uh, it's worth a short side trip. So that was great. Saw a uh, black bear, believe it or not, down in uh, what we think is Devil's Creek. So that was a real treat. Um, day one, black bear, check. So now we're just heading uh, uh, on our way to Ledbetter. Well, it, it held off as long as it could, but uh, here it comes. Uh, I think it's gonna rain intermittently uh, pretty much the rest of the day, so we're just trying to get to lead better. That was the Catawba Overlook. Just got the tarp up here at camp and a thunderstorm just broke loose. Um, yeah, it was pretty nice, um, but I had everything set up, everything dry under the tarp. Going to be a great night. Uh, we're pretty beat. We did about 25, 26 miles today. So great, great, great first day. Setting ourselves up for tomorrow. So looking forward to that. Shell Toey Trace. Ding dong. Great morning, just starting out. A little later start than yesterday. But uh, day two on the Shell Toey. break here at Peter's Mountain Trailhead and uh, great uh, pit toilets here and trying to take this opportunity and what little bit of sun we have to dry some stuff out but uh, we'll see more uh, afternoon showers 
Nice little refreshing pit stop for the morning, but we are soon back on the trail. Finally out of the creek. That was a great little section right there. Took another uh, break here at the Great Meadows Campground, a great looking campground with a beautiful river uh, access, creek access here. Very good, lovely. So now uh, we're heading back out on the trail. Shell Toey. Now we're back on the trail. We've got quite a few miles ahead of us today and we're not sure about the camping situation. So it could be a little tricky come, uh, come tonight. Join us out here on the Shell Toy Trace, though, having a great, great time. The rain's held off so far, but we're uh, expecting it any minute. So, here we go. Shell Toey, day two, 21 miles, no rain today. Uh, we'll see what tomorrow brings. Great day out here on the Shell Toey. Uh, a lot of horse trails today though, it's been rough. It's been real rough, uh, pretty muddy 
and spots um, with some gorgeous, spectacular highlights. So all in all, a great day. Uh, number three for us. And uh, we're getting closer. We're almost to uh, Bandy Creek right now. We're gonna stop and uh, reassess. We have a great campsite here next to Falls Branch Falls. It's been a great day here on the Shell Toey. Another amazing 20 miles plus. Can't wait for tomorrow. I'm going to uh, get some quick dinner and uh, hit the hay. Let's check in in the morning. I was here about three years ago with my brother-in-law and this was the most spectacular place. Icicles everywhere just hanging from the rock cliffs. It was beautiful and eerie and magical. Check out the Big South Fork video for that. Day four out here on the Shell Toey. Man, this trail is just getting better and better. What an amazing trail. Um, I don't even know how far we have. Um, something like probably 10 or 12 miles from the end, I don't know. Just past the uh, O&W Bridge. Beautiful, beautiful camp last night and a great, great morning. Saw a lot of people uh, coming out of the trails. Uh, Sunday out here, so uh, a lot of people out. But it's been, uh, it's been really a great, great day. So, day four, out on the Shell Toey, let's go. Almost to Honey Creek uh, Trailhead. Um, this Shell Toey Trace has just been absolutely amazing. Such a great way to see the state of Kentucky. Um, it's been just wonderful. I can hardly put it into words. I'm getting so excited to uh, get this close to the uh, end. Um, on our way.
I've got about six miles to go here on the Sheltoe. And uh, I want to say thank you to the uh, Sheltoe Trace Association. Um, they have a lot of resources online and uh, it's been a lot of help between uh, the trail guide and uh, just the Facebook page and all, all the information shared, all the great uh, photos. And it's been, uh, it's been great. Even met some people here uh, on the trail uh, that are also in the group. So, so that's been fantastic. So all the people who maintain this, it's a wonderful trail. So thank you very much for your hard work. We're closing in on the end of the Sheltoe. This is the last climb. We go on top of this ridge, across the ridge for a while, and then down. This is the last climb on the Sheltoe Trace. Uh, I want to take this opportunity to say thank you to my sister and my mother for, um, for everything they've done throughout this uh, to help me uh, accomplish this goal. Oh, excuse me to help me accomplish this goal and uh, I want to say thank you to them thank you just a little over three miles left here on the Sheltoe Trace and uh, most importantly I want to thank my wife and my kids um, thank you for allowing me to get out here and do this and being supportive I appreciate it and thank you I love you all.